The Age of Adeline movie is about how Blake Lively stops aging at 29 years old. Sounds cool until you realize that's another reason to hate her. <laughs> Just ask your girlfriend, probably will say, I'm not watching that movie where the bitch don't age. <laughs> but in the movie, when she's exposed to lightning and cold water, it makes her cells frozen in time. And at this point, you begin to wonder, where's Professor X? Because <laughs> if this is true, she's one hot mutant. <laughs> and somebody needs to rewrite history because Ponce de Leon was way off. <laughs> the Fountain of Youth is closer to Martinez, California. <laughs> but big drama happens when she runs into her old flame, Harrison Ford. And he's instantly attracted to her. And she's Instantly not. <laughs> because there's nothing sexy about arthritis. <laughs> but even bigger drama happens when she learns her boyfriend's dad is Harrison Ford. <laughs> yeah, there's no easy way to sugarcoat that conversation. <laughs> she gets to tell the boyfriend, I was with your dad, and by the way, I'm 107. <laughs> That's like the worst secret ever. <laughs> but when you reach 107, it really makes you question the teachings of that great philosopher Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> you know, he was a little short-sighted when he said, all right, all right, I get older, and they stay the same age. <laughs> Sorry, that impression is more like Eeyore. 